hello guys welcome to my channel so today we are going to work on this problem java string tokens and this video is in continuation with the already ongoing series of hackering that you can find on my channel so there are a lot of videos that I have posted and there will be a lot of videos that I'm going to post on these topics introduction has been completed so we are working on string now so before we jump on to this problem if you are new to my channel if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please do it will really uh, motivate me enough uh, to continue on my journey and I'll be really thankful to you so let's jump to this problem so um, here it says that we will have a string s and then we have to match the regular expression as capital letters small letters and then we have space exclamation mark comma question mark full stop underscore and then this um, I forgot what to say uh, comma uh, quote and then at and that's it so we have to match the regular expression with this and then we have to split the string into tokens then we have to define a token to one or more consecutive English alphabet letters and then we have to print the number of tokens. So this is a lot to take in if you haven't worked on regular expression yet. But let me give you this. So here we have a string sentence, right? So here we have this space, then we have this comma and then space, then we have this quote symbol, then we have question mark what do they want us to do is that we have to separate each word with the delimiters so first we have to print out the length or the size of the words this string is containing so when we say word we also mean i s n and then t as two words so here if you see you can see that they are two separate words so we will count them as 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. So first we have to print the count and then we have to s uh, separately print them by um, new uh, line system.out.println, right? So here they have given us a note to use spring dot string dot split method. If you go to this link, you will find a doc uh to how to use it and things like that so this talk is really really helpful you can also see the examples here right you can do that and i'm not going to worry about this line because i have found one more way to do it so what i'm going to do is they have given us an input and output so what I understand by this is that we have to separate or split the string using spaces, space, comma, this quote mark, this quotation mark, and we have to figure uh, something related to exclamation points also, comma also, oh yeah, apostrophe, I forgot that. At, so these all, I these all I have to taken as an account when I'm doing a split so what I will do is I will just write one thing here so when we split a string we get an array back so that's like the most basic thing which you can see also here that the return type of this mapping is a string array so I'll just do here string and let's do array air so now I'm trying to split so I can split using space so when I do this, I will get all the, so let me print this out first. Okay, it, it will not do that, so I have to iterate. So string str air system dot out dot print in and then I'll just do str. So when I do this, you will see uh, the example more clearly that it is actually splitting each and every word using this space as delimiter but we forgot comma 
we forgot apostrophe we forgot exclamation mark so we have to take in those also so when we have multiple delimiters we use this so if you right now just do this it is going to again take in space as the only delimiter so let's wait for it so see no um, no difference when we when you do this it means that these plus right so any other characters uh, with those delimiters will also get uh, uh, split it like we will also consider them as a character to be uh, to be used as delimiter so here there is no difference but when I do space and then I'll include all of them right in the in then in any order that you want so I'll just do one by one exclamation point comma question mark right periods underscore and then we had apostrophe and at symbol I hope I'm right there so I think I haven't left anything here so if you do this so you can see that we got the expected output right T H E I S N boy everything similar but we left out the size of the array so this is working as per expectation but when you say space here there is one more thing that you can do is slash slash s being space so if you do that too you will see the same output so there are two ways to do it right because some of us can can uh, consider or may not consider this as space right so any way you can use but before actually printing out the array items we just have to print out the length also so we'll just do add dot length and that's it that is all we had to do so if we run this code it should work perfectly good and it's working so this was all for this video um, I hope okay some test cases are failing and I cannot unlock this okay let me see what went wrong okay let me try one thing because I'm thinking that I might be having some extra leading spaces so let me do uh, start trim first let's see because I'm not um, like okay one more is failing what could be the reason I don't want to open this hidden test case because uh, mystery could be solved in that case and uh, if you are going for an interview like an online interview most of the test cases are not visible to you so so you should always think about more solutions to fix this so uh, let me do one thing let me create a length carry uh, variable to hold the length right and let me do a if condition if str dot equals leading white space then only print this and I have to iterate one more time to reduce the length also one sec if it is equals so I have to print out the length first so I have to use another for loop okay so if str dot equals this then length minus minus let's see 
uh, did I forgot to print the length oh, yes I did system dot out dot print ln and then we'll do length here uh, first let's try to run the code okay Th let's try to submit whoa uh, so yeah uh, leading white space was the problem so I'm not sure why trim did not work it should um, but yeah you have this solution too so I hope I have given you one more solution or one more way to fix this so if you have loved the content you can hit the like button you can hit the subscribe button and and yeah that that is all I can ask from you and I hope I will meet you in the next video of this series um, see you till then and have a good day bye bye guys